What's going on YouTube? Today we're going to be putting a Huston, Hust, Hudson valve onto a 55 gallon drum and we're going to show you how to do it. So if you're looking to put a Hust, Hudson valve into your uh, 55 gallon drum so you can have it automatically shut off once you are adding water to it or whatnot, make sure you stay tuned, watch this video and uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give it a thumbs up and leave some comments or questions you may have. All that uh, helps the channel grow and we truly appreciate it. So let's get started and put this Hudson valve in. Okay, at first we're gonna cut the top off this five gallon bucket. And we're gonna leave about two inches from the ring. Okay, we're gonna take that ring and place it on top of the 55 gallon drum. And we're gonna draw us a line so we can trace what we need to cut out. Then we're going to cut us out a little pocket hole. And we're going to use our jigsaw to cut the circle out from the top of this 55 gallon drum. Now we want to sand down the edges from where we cut out the hole and make sure it's nice and smooth and do the same thing with our ring just to make sure we get all the shavings off. Now we are getting ready to cut out the hole at the bottom for our water to come out. We're going to use a one and a half inch bit. Okay, you want to be about three or four inches from the bottom and that is about at the five gallon mark on a 55 gallon drum so that's where we're lining up to uh, cut out our hole and after you cut that out you want to make sure you sand that and get it all the shavings out from that hole Now we are going to add the bulkhead to the bottom of the tank and we're going to slide that in by reaching in through the hole and pushing it through as I put the fitting and the nut on, tighten them down, make sure I got them all nice and tight as you can see. Now we are going to add Bell fitting now I'm going to add a 3 4 shut off valve so I'm get that nice and tight then going to add another male fitting going to add a garden hose Y that has shut offs on them so that way one side can be for the pressure washer and the other side can be for a clean out. We're going to add glue to the ring all the way around there, push it in there and we can screw the lid on. Alright so we glued the top on See, it's nice and stuck on there. And then for the lid, this is a one inch. It goes into one inch. The thread is to uh, three quarter. And then we put a three quarter mill on it so we can hook the garden hose right to this. And then at the bottom, we got a, an extension, one inch, again, going into that. I was hoping that might have the sizes and stuff, but I don't see it on there. So, so, yeah, so one inch, and then it's threaded one inch, so then we hook up the Hudson valve straight to that. 
and then we'll put that lid on there. And just hook the garden hose to that. And down here at the bottom, we've got our on and off valve with uh, a Y, so that way we can have a and have a clean out right here and straight to the pressure washer right there. And then we can shut it, shut the main water off right there, or shut one or the other off. And with the way we uh, had the Hudson valve extended and stuff, we look. It does bring it a little low. I think we're probably around the around the 50 mark, 50 gallons. So we probably will redo this if this causes us any problems and get rid of the that long pipe, this pipe right here. If it does cause us any problems, that pipe right there we'll get rid of. And then that'll just bring the Hudson valve up a lot closer. And then that way we can fill it up. But we're gonna test this out first and see if it works out good or not. If it works out good, then we'll leave it. If it causes some problems, then we'll change it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. We truly appreciate it. Helps our channel grow and helps us uh, keep making content. If you guys got any other uh, videos that you'd like to see or want to see how we've done something, leave it in the comments below. Truly appreciate it. Hopefully give us a thumbs up. And uh, until next time, guys. Later, everyone.